rin ti ani ciol meri awal ma ko do ma ciu da yu kolon o ke ko an an tu e ngai piu na run kuluar ka piu ba war before before actually this project the women were facing the few women actually who were participating farming in this in this farm they they, they got a lot of challenges one uh, the, the access to water okay they were moving a distance of half a kilometer to the riverside to have to fetch water to come and water their, their crops in the farm. So this one was one of the biggest challenges. And then also the other thing is uh, uh, they lacked a lot of skills. They were still using uh, traditional methods of what? Of farming practices. But as we intervened in, we gave them a lot of capacity building. Uh, in uh, make, uh, to understand what farming as a business is. Umla currently is working with CODED uh, in piloting this solar palm irrigation system and uh, we are piloting it in uh, the Blue House and we are supporting 30 uh, uh, beneficiaries, 28 women and 2 men who are participating in this project in, 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 in BOR. This project is supported by COD8 and implemented by UMYMPDA. The goal of this project is to support and empower women through solar power pumps irrigation and increase food security, productivity and to contribute to climate change mitigation. Uh, we have provided several training. Uh, one is uh, on Nasara Bed establishment. Uh, seed product on a, on a replica, replication. We introduce them to savings and loan association. Uh, one of the criteria we use for choosing these women, uh, those who are willing to, uh, to participate in the farming as a business. And then also, we also look at the aspect of vulnerability level. Like most of these women you are seeing farming here, most of them, they are widows. So we gave them that, that, that opportunity. I am As the leader of the production group, she chose to live next to the agriculture field. Not only does she manage her own field, but also organize other members to work and discuss together. In the past, agricultural production in Bor is mostly dependent on rainfall. It's so difficult to plant anything during dry seasons. With the solar power pumps irrigation system, problems are solved now. Farmers can plant and sell in the whole year. They use for supporting their families. Even others are using the money they are getting, sending their children to school, buying scholastic materials, buying food in the home. Even others have gone ahead and they have even bought goats, which they are rearing in their homes. Ayang is preparing fruit and vegetables and going to sell them in the local market. 
For their group, they are doing this two to three times per week, depending on harvest. Today's sale is good. They almost sold ore in 15 minutes. Everyone is satisfied and wish they had brought more. The biggest achievement, the women have been empowered. That is one thing. The income they are getting, empowering them to do something, is already a success. And then the other thing is also installation of this big investment in the farm is an achievement, which was not there before. These are some of the big achievements I see in the farm. During the serious flood in Bor, many fields are destroyed. This project is helping the farmer as well as maintaining a stable food supply to the local market. We shall still maintain this farm and then also replicate this model to other locations within Bor, because we see there's really need for demand for vegetables in Bor. And when you go to the market, most of the green vegetables you see they are coming from Uganda, the tomatoes, onions. So we want these things to be grown locally. Recently, serious flood in Bor has shown that climate change has incurred more disaster risks. Many farms in Bor are using petrol fuel for irrigation, which pose more harm to climate change. Now, the successful experience of applying solar power irrigation for agriculture has proved that while we improve the livelihoods of the farmers with irrigation, we can still save our environment by using clean solar energy and in fact it saves a lot of their costs.